Ow! Hey, my god. Welcome everybody to the Sin Adventure. We're going to be taking a look at the Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements website today. We're going to be looking up the Son of Honeysuckle. And when we're on this website, they've got a bunch of different options as you can see above me here. If you haven't taken a look at this shave soap uh, company yet, a good way to start is right over here in their sample kit. And we're looking at the shave soap. I recommend maybe getting the unscented. And then we're going to go ahead and head back up to the sample section. You get over to this aftershave cologne area. And as you can see, there is so many different scents. So pick up some sample shave soap, pick out a couple of these 99 cent uh, aftershave and cologne, and boom, nice little introduction to the company at a good price. If you're new to wet shaving altogether, you can see over here, we do have these great starter kits. Seriously, out of all the companies, these guys make one of the best starter kits out there. Good razor, good brush, and they make a great gift as well. But uh, Sun Honeysuckle, let's type that in up here at the top. Let's see what they got. We got a few different bundles of the CK1 and the CK6 blends. We also have the shave soap by itself, and that's what we'll pick up a little bit later today. But as we make our way down this list here, they also have shampoo bars, which are great. If you haven't had the shampoo bar, I recommend you try one. We also have regular soap bars over here, and we also have some natural deodorant. They also offer this scent in a beard oil and a beard balm if you're interested in that. But take a look at this bad boy. I didn't even know they have the secret menu. Where is that at? Secret menu up here. And this is the Atomic Honeysuckle Bay Rum. That sounds crazy wicked good. Okay guys, let's throw these guys in our cart. We've got the uh, CK6 blended honeysuckle shave soap in the cart. We're gonna come over here to the Star Jellies. Star Jelly is a great aftershave if you haven't tried it. And we're gonna click the Unmentholated. All right, both of these items are in our cart. We're gonna say cash out. And if you sign up to their like fan page, website deal, they will give you some sort of promo code over here and you can knock that price down a little bit more. So let's check out and uh, wait for the mail. Yeah, come in. Hey, what's this I hear? You don't wanna get pollinated. Dad, it sucks getting pollinated. I don't like it. Hey, that's how you grow up to be a strong flower. I don't even care. I don't even wanna be one. I'll tell your grandma, you're gonna grow up to be wilty. All right then, I'm up. Let's go get pollinated, Dad. Yeah, I think you made the right choice today, son. It's mail call, and we have the Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Son of Honeysuckle in the CK6 soap base. The art on the front looks really cool. We get the monster honeysuckle kidnapping this lady, and then the pour from the PAA always looks fantastic. It's like fresh, kind of mountainy, rocky, the soap is soft, it feels good, and it's very fragrant right now. Now we did get the Star Jelly in the non-menthol, and it comes in a UV protective bottle. As you can see, we do get a very thick viscosity, and it melts right away to the touch of the finger. We're gonna take a pinch of joy right out of this container. Almost hurts me to ruin such a nice little pour. As you can see, this is a very soft and smooth soap. We're gonna put some in the bottom of the shave bowl and we're gonna bloom it up. We're gonna do that by taking some hot water, placing it in the bowl, and putting it to the side for about 15 minutes. The Son of Honeysuckle scent will have the more sophisticated side of the Japanese honeysuckle flower, bolder, deeper, expressions of the true blossom. Listed down below are the ingredients for the CK6 blend. All these butters and oils not only will create a great lather, but also nourish the skin. And speaking of skin nourishment, the star of the show is the star jelly. With aloe vera, cider vinegar, and yucca root, this thing's really gonna rehydrate and bring that skin back to life after a shave. We have this soap all bloomed up, and you see I'm gonna load this brush with all that bloom water. It's kind of a little too much water, but this soap is pretty thirsty and it will mix up nice. After mixing it for a little bit, we do get this very nice, soft, it's light, fluffy type of lather. It's really nice. I was surprised that I was able to get it from that watery state to this nice, puffy state right here. Now we're gonna try this on the skin and we will get back to you in just a moment. Welcome back from that up close look, the label, product, all the info. I'm joined here with our scent specialist, Cuddles, and my wife, Yuck Ching. 
and we're going to go ahead and uh, sniff this soap and tell you what we think about it. For the actual feel on the skin, it was great. I've got a nice smooth feel to my skin. I love the uh, I love the Star Jelly. This is one of the best one of the best aftershaves I think you can actually get. Yuxing, we're gonna go ahead and just open this up and uh, give us your first thoughts, your impressions, your your uh, what's on your mind. It's like a honeysuckle flower with peanut butter mix. Peanut butter mix. I, I can't. Wait. It's just really. I don't even know where she comes <laughs> up with these scent profiles. Mm. I get no peanut here. Pe mangly smell like a honeysuckle flower. It's kind of like. I get a really strong pollen. Pollen with honey. If you ever took like honeysuckles when you were a kid and you pull them off and you can suck a little bit of the nectar out. This right here smells just like that. It brings back a lot of memories of, uh, you know, picking honeysuckles as a kid. It was yes. fun. Slightly smell like peanut butter in the background. I do not get any peanut butter. Uh, let me know in the comments down below if you've ever sniffed a little bit of peanut butter off the top of the Son of Honeysuckle. I might have gone over this, but I love the way the pour looks in here. It just looks so um, I thought you organic might and real. No, that's just kind of how they pour it in. It has this real natural fall where it may look to it. And uh, I really like that about his soaps. The CK6 is definitely the higher end of the line. But if you're going to be getting this in the CK1, I mean, that is still an excellent soap. You could go either way and, and be happy with uh, either one of the soap bases. All right. How does this smell on me? Then it just smells like this thing. All right. Then I guess that's good. It matches the scent of the soap. All in all, I love the Son of Honeysuckle scent. This is one of probably my favorite scents from this company. But looking at this label here, we, we have this woman being eaten by some sort of honeysuckle monster. Wow. It's kind of cool. Each one of the labels, he's got a really neat artwork. And I believe I got a little comic book up here. He does uh, comic books that kind of tie the it's story sweet. of the scent it's into... The whole you know fandom of the the brand here it has a blood here right blood is she eaten by honeysuckle and she's bleeding a bunch is that I mean, blood yeah that might be blood as you can see here i got a plastic bag with a bunch of these little scents in here uh we were thinking about doing a video where we smell these and kind of put them into classifications of favorite fruity favorite colony favorite wow. dark favorite whatever there's like 50 or 60 cents here. But if you'd be interested in a video like that, let me know in the comments down below and I'll put that together. It'll probably be somewhat time consuming. So I figured I'd run it by you if no one's interested in seeing a 50 cent combo scent sniffing selection video. I, I haven't worked out the title of this thing yet. But we then sniff, I won't make it. We sniffed some of it. They're very amazing. Like lots of them, they like really blow my mind. Like this is the thing I like to use. Every day you can pick different scents. This stuff is really good. There's some good scents in there. And uh, we won't. We don't want to spoil the uh, sampler scent spectacular showcase video review. <laughs> <laughs> Let me know if you guys have tried PAA or this son of honeysuckle in the comments down below share your experience for other people that are either new to wet shaving or just interested in picking out this scent yo ching let's wrap this thing up before you start diving in other scents um yeah Give me these those are really fun to have okay sure. dial in the scent what are you thinking what's the last hurrah here what should i say uh waiting one to ten <laughs> sure I, I give it an 8. An 8, eight out of 10? 9, yeah. That's pretty good. It's just a very, I think it's very like an easy to accept kind of sense. Like, you know, most people probably will like it. All right, guys, that's going to wrap this video up. If you liked, you liked the video. Share, subscribe. You already know how YouTube works, guys. We'll see you on the next video. Peace.